Hey guys, it's Jocelyn. Welcome back to my channel. As you can see from the title, today I'm back with another hair removal video because most of you that come to my page, my channel, gravitate towards the hair removal videos. So why not bring you another one because you love it so much. So we are testing the Ultima Sugar Wax today. So originally I saw this on TikTok and my dumb self read it backwards because the girl's video was mirrored and I was like, Amitlu, Amitlu, like what is this wax? I tried to Google it, my Amazon and everything. Couldn't find it and then I realized I was spelling it backwards. So before getting into this video, please subscribe if you have not done so yet. Like, comment, share, and we'll get to the video right now. So this is a 43 ounce of sugar wax. If you don't know what sugar wax is, it's sugar. <laughs> Mixed with water, lemon, I don't know the exact recipe for this one obviously, but you can make sugar wax at home. There's plenty of videos on YouTube to do so. I tried to follow those and I managed to fail every time. So here we are with a purchased tub this time. <laughs> Good thing about sugar wax is that it doesn't stick to your skin. It just sticks to your hair, pulls it out, and so it's supposed to hurt less than, you know, regular waxing or hard wax. It's also super easy to take off the residue because it's made with sugar, it will dissolve with water. So you just have to wash it off, literally. No oils or special sprays to take out the residue stickiness easy so for me sugar wax has been the easiest to use in that sense but today we're going to try this one <sighs> on my way overgrown underarm hair and before anybody comes for me in the comments yes I already took a shower washed them exfoliated and dried them off camera I'm not gonna do that on camera obviously so you're supposed to use a glove for this I'll be honest, I've done it without a glove before in the past because it kind of gets stick all stuck to the glove and it's a mess. Alright, see it's already sticking to the glove all over the place. But basically, you want to take a clump and do this type of movement to get it ready to spread. And then you're going to spread it onto the area against the air growth and pull it, well flick it, you like flick motion, and then flick it with the hair growth and the more you play with it the more you use it to wax and pick up the hair because you're going to use this ball over and over again the lighter the wax becomes look it's already becoming lighter from me just twirling it in my hands okay here we go so my armpit hair grows in different directions so this one we're going to go against Hopefully, ow, there we go. Yeah, go. I don't know if you can, it's too blurry, but picked up some hair. Again, I rather do this with very clean hands because the gloves just get really stuck to the, to the wax. But here we go again. So this is what happens when your hair is too long for this, okay? It's not coming out as smoothly as it can, but it's way less painful. And it's faster, to me it's way faster than hard wax. In hard wax you have to sit there and let it get hard, so it takes time. So look, look how the wax is looking. It's getting lighter, there's hair all over the place. It's also getting lighter because it's getting full of your dead skin cells. Which sounds nasty, but hey, it's getting the job done, I mean. It's getting the job done. <clears throat> so I'm basically almost done with this side. I'm going to do the other one off camera and finish this one off camera. But as you saw, that was like super fast. Did it in, what, two minutes maybe? 
maybe less so it's really easy for you to do at home yourself it's inexpensive because even though this was 35 dollars look how much comes with it you only need a little bit at a time i'm pretty sure it's going to last me like all year and you could use it on your legs you could use it on your nether regions <laughs> but good luck with that um your underarms i haven't tried it on my face like my sideburns i'm sure it must work all right i'm back i did both sides um i still have a few hairs i could just tweeze those out but look at how nasty this wax looks that's full of hair it's disgusting and i also forgot to mention that if you're sweating you could put some baby powder because if you're sweating and you try to do this wax the wax starts melting it gets a little messy and it doesn't pick up the hair like it should so put some baby powder make it dry um maybe do it in a ventilated area where air is hitting you so you're not sweating because like i started sweating but i sweat all the time so whatever but i had to take a break i had to dry up but all in all it took me like five minutes to wax both armpits easy fast get you a tub of this trust me it's worth the money worth the investment go do it yourself because me i don't feel like going to the wax place and paying x amount of money to get wax that's just my opinion obviously they're professionals this is what they do for a living no shade to them i think it's a cool job actually and i just don't want to come lazy i'm lazy and i don't want to spend more money than i have to and this is perfect to just have at home when you want to just buy <laughs> that's the end of this video i hope you enjoyed this get yourself a tub of this ultima sugar wax luxury pro sugaring paste for hair removal ultima i should be a spokesperson right <laughs> again please subscribe i would really appreciate it like it share leave a comment and i will be back in the next video bye